guys and welcome to my channel. Uh, it's such a festive season now, Christmas coming up. Um, I have a perfect dessert for you to make um, for Christmas dinner. Uh, it's very English, uh, mince pies, and I love them. I've discovered them when I came to UK and I just fell in love with them. And I hope you enjoy them as well. Okay, ingredients are going to be needing about 400 grams of minced meat. You can make your own or buy it in store. Uh, I've got 225 grams of unsalted butter, one egg, um, a bit of cold water. We're going to be using that when we need the dough, and about 350 grams of flour. Okay, first of all, we need to make our dough. Um, so all we have to do is now mix our butter with our dry ingredient flour, and mix it until you get that sandy consistency and I'll show you what to do next. Okay, so dough looks like this. Now we beat one egg and add that into the mixture and mix very quickly. We don't want the dough to become very really warm. Okay, so now I'm just going to add a little teaspoon of cold water. You don't need a lot because my dough is pretty easy to work with. And we just mix that in. Okay, so the dough should look like this. Um, now you put it on a um, surface with tin foil or cling film, which I'm using. Press it down and just close it. Now this will have to go in the fridge um, for about half an hour, and the reason for that is because it will be much easier to work with the dough later on. Okay, my dough is ready. I've uh, put some flour on on our work surface so it doesn't stick. We're going to cut off one third um, for the tops of our mince pies and use that in a bit. Now we're just going to have to roll out our dough and make the little cupcakes. <laughs> okay, so I've got my cupcake holder with six mince pies that I'm going to make. We use a cutting. You can also use any cup, whatever you have in the house, to make sure it's going to cover all the bottom and all the sides. So we just cut it out. And obviously whatever we have left, we just re-roll and make more. So just take it. Place it inside. And do the rest. Okay, these are all done. Now we get our minced meat and just um, press a little bit down to make sure they're in place. And I would say about one tablespoon of filling into each mince pie. Just like that. Okay, they're all done and filled. Um, now I'm just going to roll the, re the, rest of <laughs> the rest of my dough and cut them into um, Christmas tree and star shapes and then we're just going to put that on top. I'll show you now. Okay, these are all done. So we just put the stars and Christmas trees like that. Now I've beaten some egg. Um, I'm going to paint them, brush them with some egg yolk and stuff. You don't have to do it, but I just think it kind of gives it more of a golden color and just looks much prettier. I've preheated my oven to 200 degrees and we're going to bake these for about 20 minutes. Obviously until they're golden brown, just take them out. Okay, my pies are done. It smells absolutely delicious in this house now. Look at these. Wow. So cute. Okay, now the last thing we have to do is just sprinkle some icing sugar on top. Now that's optional. Oh, windy. <laughs> some icing sugar. Not too much because we want to still keep the beautiful shapes of our Christmas trees and stars. And just I'll leave them to cool down and then we'll take them out. Okay, look at these beautiful, beautiful mince pies. And they're all done. Um, guys, really hope you enjoyed watching my video. I hope you try these recipes as well. Um, if you want to give me a Christmas present, then please subscribe to my channel. It will be the best Christmas present ever. Um, I really want to try one of these. It's still really hot. I'm um, just going to have a little bite. Mm. Oh my god. You can see the minced meat inside. It is so good. I love them. Please try it. Let me know how it turns out. Merry Christmas. Bye.